I guess I guess Charlie D'Amelio's ex-boyfriend uh, posted a TikTok exposing her or whatever, and now. I wasn't even gonna make a video on this, but I got a lot of requests and you know, I actually have something to say about the situation. Anyway, so here they are. He says, I miss her. Uh, this again, TikTok insiders posted it. He said, talk about taking it now. <laughs> And, uh, and yeah, once again, you know, I miss her, whatever. This is what I kind of see wrong with it, okay? The only reason why you're making this TikTok is because you want it to go viral and let the whole world know you were once dating Charlie D'Amelio in high school or something. You want it to go viral so you can get famous. That's what you're trying to do. I mean, clearly she doesn't miss you though, or else you'd be in contact with her, you know? You wouldn't have ever made this TikTok if you had contact with Charlie. So, so this is either your way of getting famous or this is your way of getting Charlie's attention and just praying she sends you a message. I think it's very petty a lot of times when somebody becomes very successful and you have somebody from their high school or whatever back in the day and then they try to expose you. You know what I mean? Oh, I went to school with them. I dated them. This is what they're like. No, dude, this is your chance to get famous. That's what you're doing. Who knows though? Maybe the guy does miss her. I don't know. Peace.